So welcome back my students. So the topic is nutrition in plants and animals. This is the last hormone topic that is a biology topic. So by the end of this class, uh, rather topic, you the learner should be able to uh, first of all define nutrition and state its importance in living organisms. So before we look out at, uh, we check out other objectives, let's try define uh, nutrition and have an understanding of the same. So nutrition is the process by which organisms um, obtain food materials. So what's the importance? It provides living organisms with raw materials for respiration, growth of cells, and repair of worn out or damaged tissues such as healing wounds. So we have two types of nutrition. We have autotropic nutrition is where plants containing chlorophyll make their own food. And we have a heterotrophic nutrition. This is where the organisms take in or ingest food from plants or animals. And that's, that's it. Those are the two types of nutrition. So with that little background, then we can look at the other objectives that we look at in our classes that will follow so having defined nutrition and uh, had that small discussion on its importance then we should be able to differentiate the various modes of feeding describe photosynthesis and show its importance in nature explain how the leaf uh, is adapted to photosynthesis explain the factors affecting photosynthesis Distinguish between carbohydrates, proteins, and lipids. State the importance of various chemical compounds in plants and animals. Relate various types of teeth in mammals to their feeding habits. Describe internal structure of mammation teeth. Differentiate between omnivorous, carnivorous, and herbivorous modes of feeding. Uh, maybe relate the structures of the mammalian alimentary canal to their functions. Try explain um, the role of enzymes in digestion in a mammal. Explain the properties and functions of enzymes. And finally, try explain the factors that determine energy requirements in humans. So see you in our next class when we discuss all this. Also get the biology application. Uh, the link is in the description of this video so that you get to study all these on your own. So see you in our next class.